Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for stopping by. Today I'm going to share with you this classic black smoky eye tutorial. I think this makeup look never goes out of fashion. And before starting, if you are new here, then hi, I am Nita. I upload makeup, hair care, skincare and beauty related videos almost every alternative day. So if you want to know how I created this look, then please keep on watching. I already did my brows off the camera using this Maybelline Tattoo Studio Brow Pomade in the shade Black Brown. Now I'm taking this Makeup Revolution Concealer in the shade C7 and I'm just cleaning up the borders. I already shared with you my brow routine. If you want to know, I will link that video down in the description bar below so please do check that out. I also applied the same concealer on my eyelids to prime them for eyeshadows. Now I'm just blending it out using a damp beauty sponge. I'm taking this airspan loose powder and I'm just setting the concealer so that it does not crease. Now I'm taking this warm brown eyeshadow from my Makeup Revolution Velvet Teddy Palette and I'm just applying it slightly above my crease because I have hooded eyes. If you do not have hooded eyes then apply the color directly onto your crease and for doing that I'm using a fluffier blending brush. I'm just intensifying the color. And I'm taking this light brown shadow from the same palette and I'm just diffusing the borders so that there is a nice and smooth transition. And I'm taking this Maybelline Eye Studio gel eyeliner and with this flat brush I'm just applying it on my eyelids. You can use any gel eyeliner or kajal pencil that you have for this step. And I'm taking the black eyeshadow from the same palette and with this e.l.f. blending brush I'm just setting the gel eyeliner and then I will be blending it with my transition color. Now this may take some time but you know you have to be patient and just keep blending it and it will be all perfect trust me just taking a little eyeshadow i'm just blending it it is all nicely blended and i'm taking the brown eyeshadow that i applied on my crease and i'm just applying it again now with a clean blending brush i'm just blending out the edges now i'm taking this elf poreless party primer and i'm just applying it all over on my face and neck i already moisturized my face half an hour ago so i'm not moisturizing my face again now i'm taking this l'oreal infallible 24 hour fresh breathable foundation in the shade sand beige i believe and with this real techniques beauty sponge i'm just buffing it in the shade name and the product will be mentioned in the description bar below so please do check that out now i'm using the same makeup revolution concealer under my eyes down the bridge of my nose forehead sides of my mouth chin and cupid bow and then i will be blending it out using the same damp beauty sponge now it is always advised to use a lighter concealer under your eyes whenever you are doing a black smoky eye or a dark blue smoky eye this way uh, your smoky eye will stand out even more and your face will not look dull and gloomy now i'm just setting my concealed areas using the same loose powder and for that i'm using this elf brush now i'm just setting my entire face i'm going to finish my eye makeup for that i applied tons of loose powder under my eyes so that if there is any fallout i can dust it off later and i'm using the same gel eyeliner on my waterline and as well as for tight lining and i'm applying the black eyeshadow and I'm just smudging out my lower lash line with it. 
now taking the brown eyeshadow i'm just diffusing the borders of the black eyeshadow if that makes sense now i'm applying a coat of mascara on my top and bottom lashes this is maybelline lash sensational mascara now i'm using this kiss eyelashes in bastia of the camera and i'm just dusting off the excess powder here and here is the final eye look now i'm taking this light brown shade from my nyx contour palette and i'm just contouring the parameters of my face like the hollows of my cheeks my chin nose as well as my forehead for my blush i'm using this wet and wild blush in mellow wine this is a perfect blush for this type of eye look and taking this makeup revolution pro illuminate highlighter i'm just hitting the high points of my face with this fan brush I'm also highlighting my brow bones and my inner corners using the same highlighter. Now I'm setting my entire face using this e.l.f. makeup setting spray. For my lips, first I'm lining it with this NYX lip liner in the shade Espresso, and then I'm using this NYX lip lingerie in the shade Beauty Mark. And again, I'm using this Wet n Wild liquid lipstick in this shade Sedal Later, and I'm loving this one lately. And here is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, then please hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel. Also, if you're not following me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, please do follow me there. All the links will be given in the description bar below. So please do check that out. So see you in my next video. Till then, bye and take care.